if you spend some time on freezer burns, then you might stave off the stomach churns. Rake's the frozen food master. He's best bud to your taste buds. Hi, welcome to Freezer Burns. I'm your host, Greg, the frozen food master. And you're joining me as I eat my way through the freezer aisle one box at a time. A couple weeks ago, I published a review of the Zatarans Shrimp Alfredo. Remember that review? It was a couple weeks ago, and not 24 hours later, I got an email waiting for me in my inbox from the people at Zatarans. See, I told you these companies watch my reviews. Here's what they said. I work for Zatarans, and we're sorry you didn't enjoy the Zatarans Shrimp Alfredo Frozen Entree, but we would like to offer you the opportunity to sample the newly reformulated version in hopes you have a better experience. Now, just as a reminder, that Zatarans Shrimp Alfredo meal before didn't really like it. Here's why. It was soupy. Remember, I sucked it up with a straw. The shrimp size was so minuscule, I called it a obese sea monkey. And it didn't have that New Orleans style spice that I come to enjoy with Zatarans. I wanted a little kick to it. And it was bland, soupy, and small. Zatarans has sent this to me to try out. See, it's not even in a box. Zatarans revised Shrimp Alfredo. We'll see if this is better than the one I reviewed a couple weeks ago. I'm gonna put this into the microwave, cook it identical to how I did the last one. Three minutes in the microwave, stir another minute, cook it in the microwave, and I'm gonna get this into my belly, and we're gonna see if this is any better. Okay, so I've taken this out of the microwave. First, what I did was I cut a little slit on the top, I cooked it on high for three minutes, pulled back the film, stirred it around, cooked it on high for another one minute, and here is how it looks. Uh, initial reaction, not as soupy as the other one. So that's a plus. The other thing is when I was stirring it around, I realized that the shrimp, they're bigger. They are definitely bigger than what I had before. They're still not jumbo sized shrimp. They're still maybe, you can see how this little, like how it's curled up in a circle. It's still about three quarters of an inch uh, in diameter. Um, so two out of the three already have been solved from the problems I had prior. It is still very hot. It has thickened up a lot better than what the other one was. I mean, the other one, remember, I could take a spoon to it. What I can see, I mean, sorry, a straw to it. What I could see here is that while there is some extra Alfredo sauce, it's not something that I'm like, look at that big pool of Alfredo sauce. It's in a way where I'm like, okay, that's got some extra sauce. It's saucy, saucy. It's not um, crazy dry which I, admittedly I was, a, I was a little afraid of, that they were gonna overcompensate the other way. Look at this, that is actually pretty decent looking. I'm excited about that. Let me try to get a piece of shrimp and some uh, pasta and some Alfredo. Let's see how this tastes. Okay. Again, shrimp in the microwave. The shrimp is bigger in size than what we had before. The shrimp is um, pretty well cooked for microwave shrimp. It's got a real big, like, fishy taste to it. And that's interesting. I thought the Alfredo sauce was gonna just totally cover it and mask it, but it definitely has a seafoody taste. I'm not sure if I like it or, um, or not. Let me try one just plain. Yeah, there it goes. Just that extra little shrimp kick, um, which I kind of dig. Um, but that was my initial impression that it has kind of a seafoody taste to it. But here's the best part about it. Pasta cooked very nicely. There is a little tingle and I'm feeling in the back of my throat. And that is the spice I was looking for uh, the last time I reviewed this meal. I do like that the um, that it's got this, now this tastes like New Orleans style. This tastes like Zatarans. And because it's all kind of real thickening up, I mean, that is really, really nice. Let me try one more bite because I want to make sure I do this justice. Yeah, it's got that nice spice to it. Is this a perfect meal? Absolutely not. Is this 10 times better? than what I reviewed just a mere two weeks ago. Yes, this is definitely an improvement. I'm starting to dig this. 
This is the Zatarain Shrimp Alfredo Reformulated Edition. See, I still have the box from the last time I reviewed it. Zatarain supplied me with a revised version of this. Last time I reviewed this, two and a half star rating, three problems, soupy, small shrimp, no spice. This time, all three of those were satisfied. Really dig it. Now, is it a perfect meal? No, the shrimp, not, not as perfect as it can be, um, still kind of chewy. The um, Alfredo sauce, great, great Alfredo sauce, and the pasta was, um, was a good quantity and perfectly cooked. Given all of that, I give this a four out of five star rating. Question of the day, what is your favorite thing from New Orleans, your favorite New Orleans style? Leave that in the comment section. As always, I'm your host, Greg, the Frozen Food Master. This has been another review of Freezer Burns. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Download the brand new Freezer Burns iPhone app and scan this code to access a bonus video of what I thought of this meal cooked in the oven.